Hey guys, welcome back to my craft room. So we've got a haul from over the weekend. <laughs> um, I know I probably should have posted this on Monday, but you know, we're a little late. <laughs> Plus, I don't think and these aren't going anywhere. So it sure seems like I think they're pretty much there all the time unless they're not in stock. So, but I know my store, the crafting section doesn't really sell out too fast. So hopefully if you're interested in something, you know, you can still find it. So <laughs> over, well, Thursday, I guess it's not technically the weekend. For drinks and DIYs, we did a set of gingerbread um, embroidery hoop bases for the loaded, uh, loaded hoops. And I have that burgundy paper. And I was like, dang, really wish I had some burgundy, ri burgundy ribbon to kind of match. So I went ahead and picked that guy up. He's a very thin. And they also picked up this kind of gingham. Yeah, I guess that, that would be a gingham. Very thin as well. I also have, have some other ones. Uh, it's in the other bag, though. We'll come back to it. <laughs> I also picked these guys up. I... For what they are, they're super expensive. They're like $3 a pack. But they were just so cute. <laughs> and I was like, these would be so easy to just pop a little gingerbread on. I have to get them. So I did grab those. You'll probably be seeing a shorts soon. I don't know how soon, but sometime this week with some gingerbreads added to that. <laughs> oh, and you guys know I've been looking for some gold enamel dots. Some gold glitter enamel dots. I found some expensive again, like $3 a pack. Oof. But I also got a little DIY thing to see if I can make my own. So I found some chunky, not as chunky as I wanted, but kind of chunky gold glitter only 97 cents so I think we'll give that DIY a shot and see if we can make our own enamel dots <laughs> or gems whatever you want to call them oh as I was saying about the crafting section they are redoing my paper crafting section I didn't really need these but I don't want to be without them <laughs> so I went ahead and picked up all of the ones they had left I think it was like five or six of them not much at all but, oh, here's another ribbon. I thought this would be really pretty for Christmas, like a non-traditional color. Oh, come on. Oh, it's going to look so good with maybe some teal or something. Oh, gosh. Oh, and then fabric. They have all their Christmas fabric out. Well, I don't know if it's going to be all of it, but I found this guy. A bundle of little, like, Santa gnomes. Look at his mustache. And then we have, like, a blue one. We have a little mountain range. We have some red and white stripe. And then here is... Look at them. They're so cute. <laughs> I couldn't pass it up. <laughs> Alright, here's another ribbon. Again, with that non-traditional kind of pink. Oh, look at that. So pretty. <laughs> now, something I was super excited about. I found these guys in the beading section. Well, actually, it's right next to the beading section. It's more of the container section. But it's not like container containers. It's like the crafting containers. So, but these were only a buck and I was like, gosh, dang, those are going to be awesome for embellishment boxes. And I feel like they're so much nicer than the ones at Dollar Tree. Oh, hold on. I was going to open it up and, but I ended up picking up all of them. <laughs> kind of expensive, but I was like, I know I'm going to use them anyway. I love making embellishment boxes. They're so fun. And I wasn't sure about the blue color, but I was like, you know what? It'll be fine. We'll just make it like snow themed. 
it'll be okay. Oh yeah, that is nice. That's gonna be so cool. Very cool. All right, for only a buck, so much nicer than the Dollar Tree ones, I think. But yeah, I grabbed a bunch of those. <laughs> Let's see, what else did I, oh, these guys, these fuzzy, creepy, crawly spiders, oh my gosh, I think they, oh, 98 cents. I didn't really look at their Halloween section much this year, but these caught my eye on the end cap. <laughs> oh, and because of drinks and DIYs, needed a bunch more glue sticks. <laughs> Let's see here. Oh, and I also picked up these bows. I thought these would be perfect to add to some Christmas. Just little bits of added extra here and there, you know. Most of these are the boxes. <laughs> Just kind of working around them here. Oh, here's another of the gold uh, gems, I guess. And then I grabbed another of that ribbon. It was only like 49 cents, I think. Oh, I grabbed some fabric fusion glue. I want to see how that works. Um, I think it'd be really nice to try and make my bows with it instead of using hot glue. We'll see. I feel like it won't have as much depth as I want. Okay, moved around all the boxes <laughs> and got the rest of it. I got some of this really pretty red. Come on. It's trying to focus on that box back there. There we go. Really pretty red, red ribbon. And then I also picked these up that were in the Halloween section, kind of the end cap with the spiders. They were just 97 cents. Or some different gems. I was like, okay, I'll grab them. <laughs> I'm always using them. And that purple and blue, it just like, my eye went right to it. <laughs> I was like, yes, okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> grabbed those, of course, you know. But these, these were my, I've been looking for something like that for a while. And I went in with the intention of, well, of food shopping, but <laughs> of grabbing a chunky gold glitter. And I saw these and I was like, gosh dang it, now I have to get them. Because <laughs> I knew I was going to grab them, you know, if I hadn't, or if I had found them earlier. I don't you know all, how that goes. <laughs> but here, look at those colors. Here are all of my goodies that I got. I didn't look at the Christmas section this time. It was one of those like really quick just grab some milk. <laughs> One of those kinds of trips. But then I also found these guys, so it was kind of a mega trip. <laughs> but yeah. So lots of... Um, why did I just blank on the name? Embellishment boxes. <laughs> oh, golly. <laughs> Coming up. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thanks so much for hanging out with me while I showed you my haul. I hope you guys are having a crazy day. Good crazy, not bad crazy. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.